Sensational poulet, le perfect way. Cooking perfection on weekend AM. Brought to you by Dodietrich. Welcome back. Who fancies some posh, 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 <laughs> posh, 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 fish fingers for lunch? <laughs> well, if you want whatever that is, uh, you're in luck. <laughs> Lizzie Lyons from Lizzie's uh, Little Kitchen in Listowel is in the kitchen today. Good morning, That's a tongue Lizzie. Twister. Hi, guys. Good you morning, brought Lizzie. your posh sausage rolls, which I can't believe you haven't eaten any of. No, but I'm keeping them for later. They won't be there, son. They won't be there. Anyway, what are but you I making? I want some Lizzie? of these. We are making some parmesan and hay goujons. Nice. With roasted sweet potato wedges and a homemade tartar sauce. So the first oh, thing really? we're going to get on is the sweet potato wedges. We have them wedged here. And you're going to roast them, are you, Lizzie? Yeah, we're going to roast them. Okay. Keep it nice and healthy. We swish that around. I have a little bit of salt and pepper inside there, and I've got some fresh thyme and rosemary, just nice. chopped up. If you had dried herbs, they'd do the same. Oh. And I have a little bit of um, garlic inside there as well. Lovely. So the oven is on at 190. Are you a fan of sweet potato? I am, yes. And I tried to vary it up how I'd like to eat it, because like anything, you can get bored of it. Eat it quickly uh, or slowly. Yeah, indeed, yeah. yeah. Preferably, yeah. Um. Now, so we're going to bang them into the oven there Certainly. at... Yeah, Certainly. Yeah, I'd sometimes make 180. chips out of them. If you slice them very finely, they'll, they'll crisp up in the oven really quickly. Now, yeah, I'm not a, not a no. fan. But I'm, I can be converted, can't I, Lizzie? Yes, you can. Now, on to the main event. Now, so we have some breadcrumbs inside here, a little bit of pepper, a little bit of garlic, salt, and some parmesan. And we're going to pané. Oh, Because we're going we? very posh. Oh, right. So yeah. pané now. Pané is right. just a, a, a cooking pané. term for crumbing. You're going to dip them yeah. in pané. Yeah. So the first crumbing. thing we're going to do is we have some seasoned flour, a little bit of egg, and then we've got our breadcrumb and parmesan and black pepper, oh, a little lovely. bit of garlic. Now, why, why hake? Is that just your fish of choice, or is that...? Um, I looked in the fridge. I love hake. OK. <laughs> oh, that's what was in the fridge? Yeah, gotcha. I got okay. it. I was, it was delivered on, on Wednesday fresh. So. so the alternatives could be...? You could use pollock, you could use cod. Pollock could be cheap, it's a sustainable fish, so you mm. could use that. You could use a bit of cod. Any kind of white, kind of chunky fish would do. Mm. So we're going to get this on. You're giving it a good coat of the old Yeah, we are. And we're I love get the fact the you've got the parmesan in there as well. Yeah, you can nearly smell it there now, can Beautiful. you? Beautiful. Mm. Yeah. Any danger in the, the parmesan <clears throat> burning then? No, well, you keep your pan at a reasonably warm, hot state, you know mm. what I mean? We're only going to brown them off anyway and we'll bang them into the oven then oh, afterwards. Oh, you finish them in the oven. This, yeah. this is for colour, really, isn't this it? This is for colour, exactly. Yeah. Okay. That's what we're going to do. And we're going to leave them inside there and we're just going to let them brown up. Okay. And then you're going to make a homemade tartar sauce. And we're going to make a homemade tartar sauce. Love it. Sauce. Love it. Yeah. So... We've I've got heard things some in the kingdom, Lizzie. Since I last seen you, Th it's about a week, wasn't it? A week ago, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> great in the kingdom. We've got some shallot. Yes. Finely we've diced. Finely diced. We've got some caper. Lovely. Yeah. Uh, we've got some gherkins. Have you chopped mm. the capers as well, or have they got it all? Yeah, the capers are chopped right. as well. A Beautiful. little bit of black pepper. I have to say, uh, Lizzie had some sympathy for our Laura uh, last week. Because I spent did a supper club down Lizzie's, but I spent the entire afternoon singing in the singing. kitchen. Oh Lord! Drove her singing. to distraction. We were mitered from him. Did you have a back? You could have put him out. Uh, she did. She we did. did. Yeah, back, yeah. But I came back in. Yeah. <laughs> but you had a great day and a great night. Really it was great brilliant. Night. Yeah. yeah. Great we, we had loads of people travel. Actually, we had a lovely, lovely mom and dad and son. They came from Limerick, and That's we had people right. from Wexford and Cork. It was from lovely. All over the country, mm. because. Yeah. Um, so Great. that was a bit of lemon juice at the end, is it? Lemon juice at the end, a little bit more Love of that tartar pepper. Sauce. Me too. Me oh, too. Yeah. Love it's really perfect. nice homemade. Now, if you wanted to do a healthy version of this, you could use light mayonnaise and put in a little bit of Greek yogurt because it'd yeah, be yeah. high in protein, okay. and um, that way it'd be a bit healthier if you didn't want to use a lot of mayo. But I like to do it this way because I think it's. And you can get a light mayo anyway, can't yeah, you? Yeah, exactly. Mm. Yeah. So we're going to turn these babies. You nice see they're color, lovely yeah. and brown. Lovely. Lovingit.com. And how long would you finish them in the oven for, Lizzie? You put them in for maybe about another five minutes. Okay, at what not time? Long. Um, we're putting them in at 180. Okay. So we just pop these in the front, and now I have some inside here that I prepared earlier. Good, Let's see them. Good. That's yeah. what I like to hear. So, gentlemen, if you can give me over that plate at the front that's prepared. Yes, no, love. the plate in the oh, bowl. The very much. 
There you are, my lovely. Thank you very much. And now we're going to... The devil <clears throat> is in the detail. Yeah. How long were the wedges in for? Um, the wedges, I put them in at 190. They'd need about 12 to 15 minutes, and I put them on in a high heat. Right. Um, because that way they don't go all soggy. You know, some people complain about wedges that they can go soggy when they're baked in the oven, but this is the best way to yeah. do it. Is that maybe sometimes because they're just too big? Um, well, yeah, mm. that could be it, but really, if you put them in at a low heat, like 160, they're going to get soggy. Ah, right, because yeah, so they cook very fast anyway, sweet mm. potato. So we've got our tartar here, nice. and now we're going to pop our little goujons on top. Delicioso. Yeah. Don't cook enough fish at home. My you boys... Know, I cook lots. And yeah. the, you know, Usually they... just off the pan, though. Yeah, or maybe pan just... Fries. Yeah, these roasted, are but... these are really good for the whole family. My two love these, the small lads. The kids love them. Yeah, and it's a really good way to introduce your kids to, to fish. fish. Yeah, and they still feel they're getting. Yeah, exactly. Something with a bit of fried and, feeling. Yeah, and even to get them involved in doing the panning, and I do that with the lads, Very and good, they're yeah. really interested. And can I just say? To Rory, he's at home watching me. He's got his football match today, oh. at twelve o'clock, paying for my van. Come yeah. on, Rory! Come my on, Rory! Van. And who my are they van. playing? They are playing Bale today. Well, made the best so team win. Here we go. Rory. Try it out. Right, here nice comes the cavalry. Here. That's only said that because you've horses on your top today. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> Just realised I could have been in trouble there. Ladies. <laughs> this horse pattern Thank on the top. You, Have a little taste. It smells gorgeous. Yeah. Thank it you. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Hang on, we just give away our phones. We Let's have a try. Look, we're being gentlemen You're a real gentleman. once in our lives. Okay, go on. <laughs> Thank you, Laura. Yeah. Yeah. There are only a few We'll enjoy it through you. We've got oh, we'll oh, we'll a taste of it myself, but sure, not to worry. Lizzie, thank you very much. You're very uh, welcome. Lovely to see you as always. We're going to eat them yeah. in a minute because yes, they're going to have them demolished. Okay. <laughs> uh, today's recipe details are up on our website, or you can call into Lizzie's <laughs> Little Kitchen in Listowel to try everything for yourself, and you'll be guaranteed Simon more yeah. likely than not won't be there singing. I won't be there no. singing, but they have a recording of me singing. They'll play it for you. But after the break, <laughs> how to help alleviate your teenager's <laughs> exam anxiety. See you in a few minutes. Thanks, thank Lizzie. You. Amazing souffle, the perfect way. Cooking perfection on Weekend AM. Brought to you by Dodietrich.